Hello there, guys. Craig Frost here for Ain. 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 What was that? Juicy Tuts tutorial in Adobe Premiere Pro. Who wants to learn how to do a voiceover? Well, we're going to learn how to do that. So let's say you have a video sequence uh, lined up and edited. This is just one clip of my sequence here. Uh, anyway. So, if I wanted to do a voiceover of this, how would I do it? Well, the easiest way in Premiere Pro is pretty easy. That's why it's the easiest way. So, if all your audio channels have been used up, you can come up to um, Sequence, Add Tracks, and put a zero in the video tracks and one audio tracks, and um, place it after. And then we've got another audio track here, but... I've only got one audio track being used, so it doesn't really matter. But we'll use audio for. So, what you need to do is then come over to Audio Mixer. And you want to enable track for recording. Uh, and then select which microphone input you want. I've already set this up. This may not be set up correctly, so you might have to come up to Premiere Pro Preferences. This is where it is on a Mac. It's slightly different. Uh, on the PC, but you can still find it. and then audio hardware and choose your microphone from the list of options here. Okay, and then it should appear in the list. My list is gone. Have I just messed this up? No, it's back. There we go. And then to uh, you enable it to record, and then you press this record button down um, here in the viewer. This won't start recording, so don't worry. It just enables it so that when we press play here, we will be recording along the timeline. So um, you can check your audio levels by doing a test record for a bit. So if we um, do that, so press play. And then you can see the recorded levels are coming up on the display. And um, they're not peaking. They're actually under recording a little bit there. But you can fiddle about with the levels. And then um, you're ready to record. So... Again, so if I just delete this, go back to the start, you would enable enable it to record, press record, and then press play, record whatever you're, you're wanting to speak, maybe a director's commentary or something like that. By the way, make sure that you have headphones plugged in, or mute your speakers as you're talking, otherwise you'll get feedback and it'll be horrible, and there'll be noisy stuff. Uh, so there we go, and then we'll stop recording, and then we should be able to hear back um, what it what it recorded record whatever you're you're wanting to speak maybe a director's commentary or something there like you go. that. you can hear me by the way make sure that you have headphones plugged in or mute your speakers as you talk there you go that's how you can record um, over the top of video just really quickly and easily and you can see the video in the top right as you're doing it so it's good for like I said commentaries or um, voiceovers if you're doing the David Attenborough kind of style documentary um, anyway that's how to do it so remember to rate comment and subscribe if you like this video if you don't like this video then don't do anything just go away and do something else anyway uh, follow on twitter at twitter.com forward slash juicy tuts uh, thanks for watching see you again <laughs>